We all working together from the actors to the production team to the director. We all work together to make sure one person straight. So if you got one person straight, the whole set gonna be cool by the end of the day, and that's how it's been clicking. Who do you trust? Palm Beach Connect. From Palm Beach Connect. Hey guys, this is Bria Palm Beach Connect, and we're sitting with the cast, the crew of City of War. How are you guys? Very good. 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 What's up? So the show comes back May 12th. And how do y'all feel about that? Because I know we're excited. Yeah. We've been waiting. We've been working hard. Crazy, man. Working hard the whole team. What was the delay, though, on the show? Perfection. Perfection and Perfection. Yeah, making bad. sure we put it out the right way. Yeah. Just making sure everything and every all our ducks in a row. Yeah. We got bad everything better. Got bad actors. Got bad actors. Got bad actors. Got Cameras in this go way, around. Vinny gets better every single day. Yes, so, definitely. And like I said, I like to keep it real with y'all. Like I tell y'all, we had we had a lot of issues with a lot of actors too. Like we like to keep it real. Like King, we had King go down for a little minute. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Cut off. Cut off a lot of actors. We brought Bobby in. You know what I'm saying? We got you know. We got a whole bunch of <laughs> lot of shit going on to make shit better. So, you know what I'm saying? We we doing what we got to do to make that that drop that right sauce. We start better better production, um, better management, better actors, yeah, better everything. How have you guys liked it being picked up on the Kodak? Cause the show been around before Kodak picked it up, but with him picking it up, this had make or break the show. Oh um, well, you know, with him, we get three to nine main views per episode, so, so it's definitely yeah. you know. Linking up with him has been nothing but love. As far as yeah, big ups to him. Yeah, yeah free guys, free yeah, bigger platform, free yeah, bigger like platform that. on that. Yeah. Did you think that when you started the show that it was going to be this successful, like as successful as? Well, if you met Benny, then oh, you man. definitely know that this ain't even the beginning. Man, we, we, we started <laughs> from the bottom. Is, is yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 I mean, yeah. he yeah. called me yeah. in the first yeah. episode. He was like, "Bro, yeah. I need you for the show." You know what I'm saying? I need you for the show. And then actually with me. I had already been a fan of the show, but I was in Ohio and I did the Mike Got Shot Challenge. Huh. So I yeah. came in, I drove 18 hours from Ohio, stopped everything I was doing and I live in West Palm now. On the show is Rufus. So it's just big ups to Bobby, big ups to um, Benny yeah. for bringing me into the show. So, you know, me being one of the new actors in. So it's just big ups to the whole show too. But how did we get involved in the acting for this show? Well, a lot of the characters. <laughs> <laughs> we were from the streets, man. Yeah. We were from the streets, so we were from the streets. Whenever we go to this show, you know what I'm saying? Because it's a street oh, show. Yeah, you know, yeah, like, right. it's kind of it's kind of easy on that end, you know. You know? But um, right. at the same fact, a lot of the people are already entertainers. A lot of them are musicians yeah, right. yeah, and they already comedians yeah, and stuff like but that. At the so. same time, it's not hard to get in the show. Though, Bobby. <laughs> if you know Bobby, if you know one of us, we can get you in. Cause yeah. like I told you, like before, it's open. Yeah. Like. We might not. We might have somebody supposed to show up. Might not show up. Now that's your opportunity. Yeah. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? But, you, right. but you gotta come. Too. Yeah. You just you gotta, gotta be on your way. Hey, 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 I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> Rufus came in. Yeah. Hands down, this guy is turned up. Using the camera in front of the camera. He bought four or five different characters he, inside he of the thing. Anything time, that he 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 been an extra all through that bit. He's <laughs> that in times ten. Yeah, he, yeah. Do, he do it all. He do it all. Yeah, that's that's what yeah you were just talking about. Like if you can come in, you can carry your load. Then you family, and we just gonna bring you in. We all gonna we all going to the same. <laughs> Um, to the same, uh, you know, everybody wants to be rich, everybody wants to be famous, right. and if we all work together, yeah, everybody works together. It's yeah. also, also a big, a big thing about the city of War too. it's real dead family, this just ain't no show. Yeah. This is calling everybody, man, you straight, somebody go to jail, we bunning them out, yeah. it ain't no pressure in the streets, it ain't no, if you need something done, if your family needs something, everybody is taking care yeah. of everybody, so, just to keep the show going. For the fans, you feel me? So, yeah. See, big ups to the fans too. Off the camera, right? Yeah, yeah. Right. this family, this ain't yeah. no. That's what's up, that's what's up. Yeah. I wanna say, y'all got, okay, so like you just said, it's family. And I know in the show you got a bunch of different games. Yeah. And a bunch of different games, yeah. for real. And it's well, the GQ, what you got there? You know, I'm one nation. I'm a hustle one nation. I'm one nation. I'm one nation. That's the greatest part. We all like different games. We all like different games. But that's where everything comes in because we all pull together and we're like, well, you know, we got to act. We all are part of the game. We in the same game. Yeah. But it ain't nothing but what? Savages, One Nation, GQs. And Bethany Boys, Zoe Nation. That's, that's, that's a handful, bro. That ain't that many games. Especially for characters. Yeah, Especially yeah, for yeah, characters. Yeah, you yeah. keep everybody, you know, in check and everything. So I'm glad it's like good on production. That's yeah. real, real good. 
I like the flexibility of it because, you know, one episode may not be directly directly with the next episode, but then y'all still tying the whole story together. Well, see, that's where we're going ahead and production is better, the writing is better, everything's better. Like I said, Vinny gets better every single day. Right. So, whereas the first episode took a whole entire year to actually produce, we're getting episodes done in a week or two. And everybody's on beat. We got the right team. We got the right players. We got the right actors. And like I said, everybody's just rocking and rolling, and everything's going lovely right now. That's the same. And then with Kodak's blessing, you know what I'm saying? We're gonna go ahead and get it out there to the world, and everybody's gonna see it. And um, another thing is, is that uh, we actually, whenever I jumped on board um, with the production team and everything, um, me and Benny partnered up. Uh, we ended up moving the production team up there to Atlanta, up there in Georgia. So we got a whole house up there and everything, and we're, we've been working up there. So we got other, uh, not just City of War going. We got City of War going with Kodak, and then we also got the White House. Which yeah, is big, big up to the White House. Yeah, big That's up what we dropping next. Big up to the White House. house. We already got calls from uh, rappers QC? and stuff like that to be on it, QC and stuff like that. Um, the new rapper Fujiano, they asked to hit us up and asked to be on it and stuff like that. Um, we got a couple other rappers, so that one, they're gonna, we're going to be based in Atlanta, so they're going to be able to be on it a lot more and everything, too. No, I'll um, definitely be on that one, too. Yeah, <laughs> you definitely know. on the White House, you know. Like we said, it's family shit, you know what I'm saying? So you see these faces, you don't see the hardworking faces in the next one. But um, we also got something based in L.A., too, the Life of Sin, which is going to be more like a sci-fi, like, crime type stuff. So we got a lot of stuff in the works. Well, Vinny, they all different. Vinny, yeah, they all, all different. different. Yeah, all and Vinny, Vinny, Vinny is like the team that we got going on, handpicked. Everybody's just working in sync, and we're working towards, like I said, the same goal. Because if you got a dog walking, he got four legs, they all walking in different directions, he ain't going nowhere. Mm -hmm. uh, so we work. Really keeping your show like core to YouTube and core to you guys. You guys have more freedom and flexibility with it. Yes, we do. And, um,. Not that we wouldn't like that or don't want that. You know, everybody, that's basically the end game. But um, numbers got to be right. And like you said, contracts got to be right. You know, we got to know if we're exclusive, if we can, you know, work with other people, if we're only going to be with this person, with this set, you know what I'm saying? Then we got to make sure that we have enough money to pay all our actors, make sure production gets better and be, is more on time. So it's just all about the numbers, really. And we aren't gonna let that stop us though. So we're just gonna keep on producing, we're just gonna keep on making more and more content until you know, <coughs> you know it's all right. I know the success of the show, like, you guys knew it was gonna be successful, but as it came out, it came as like, maybe like a little surprise, but what was your goal for the show in the beginning? Like, um, really just the, um, Benny, Benny's like imagination is, is huge. So they're like, the end game is like, there's no cap on it. So right from the get go, he movies and everything, basically everything that he was dreaming about and talking about is exactly what we're doing. We're we're not even there yet though, so that's the beautiful part. So you know. I feel like he has a lot of good stories that he's telling through these shows. Like, yeah, real life, real life. Right, right. people ain't conducting themselves the right way, or people not going about things right. the right way. So. How he coming? He got more. Um, what would you call it? More um, like when in the show when uh, the little dude they was talking about his mama picking on his mama. His big brother came up to him and taught him how to handle it. Like you know. Yeah, yeah. There's a lot of um, real life situations and stuff like that too. Um, basically, kind of like you know, because we got Rufus on. We got like I said this year. We got a lot of new actors. We got a lot of new stuff going on. So we, the range is just crazy. We got um, four the seasons over. We're gonna have it looking like bad boys. You know, the coronavirus <laughs> kind of messed us up, so we can't use the boats and all the jet skis and everything else. We're going to be doing a lot of stuff like that. Then we got Rufus on here, man. This guy's a character. He can do everything. He's serious. He can be funny. He can do it all. So the this season's going to be like, you know, Boys in the Hood, Minister Society, Friday, um, everything wrapped up in one. So, you know, we're going to have a full range of everything for everybody. There's going to be lessons taught in it. There's going to be a lot of action. There's going to be a lot of uh, dialogue now because we got better actors and stuff. So, it's going to be an all around better show. It's a blessing to be a part of this because I've never seen somebody work as hard as Benny. Well, I'm talking about 
editing on the computer Vinny, Vinny, after Vinny. filming, editing, yeah. staying Vinny. up oh. to four in the morning, yeah. being back up at a set Five time, eight in the morning, yeah. Yeah. being back up at eight, oh. filming the next day and yeah. making sure everybody got a shot. I ain't never seen nobody work more. And it's a blessing to be a part of that. Then he's picking out the characters. He's got to yeah. find the right person yeah. for it. Yeah. And mm -hmm. he's doing everything. He writing it too. He's writing it. Shout out to K9. Shout out to Joe. Shout out to K9. Shout out to Dean. Shout out to Dean. Yeah. 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 Shout out to Poke Cannon, man. Shout out to Poke Cannon. Everybody behind the Shout out to Poke Cannon, man. Shout out to Poke Cannon, man. Yeah, he's a hard worker. See, the thing is with him, he lead by example. He'll be up six o'clock in the morning, running two, three miles, doing his little workout yeah. thing, and then back on set. And I'm the same way I was because I uh, on a record label and uh, I do music and stuff like that in the clubs and everything. Shout out brunch whenever that comes back. Club Ivy, you know what it is Sundays. Um, also. So, you know, I'm the same way. I'm always working. I'm always working. Everybody wants to partner up with me and do stuff with me. And I've never, ever even thought about having a partner. Then Vinny came to me and was like, yo, let's start a movie production company. Let's put all the shows up underneath it. You know, um, I'm real good behind the camera. I work hard just like you do. You know what I'm saying? So I can't always be around because I'm always working. So I need somebody out there talking for me. You know, perfect yin and yang. I ain't never told him no. He's never told me no. You know what I'm saying? So it's been a perfect relationship. I never even had that with a female. You know, so with him in business and everything like that and working, if if he's showing that he's working hard like that, we're showing that we're right behind him working just as hard. It's just going to keep everybody motivated. Because a lot of times there's been times where, you know, it, like he said, we couldn't get a hold of certain actors. We put a lot of stuff on hold, you know, so it kind of, you know, it, that could break a lot of people's spirit, you know what I'm saying? But everybody being behind everybody being everybody's crutch you know what i'm saying uh, somebody's tired this so day good. somebody's picking up this you mm -hmm. know what i'm saying somebody's helping behind the camera you know it, it just makes everything make go. everything more better yeah like, like I said, it's family. Any different, like any different. You have to show be half as successful as it is now. If what? If it's, if Vinny is worth ethic, ethic worth any different than. No. Mm. Oh, this would be this would be confident. You don't know how you. Listen, I'm talking about from. Listen, I'm talking about from from waking up, filming, yeah. making sure the actors are where they're supposed to be, yeah. all the way down to once you collect your work. Going home to edit it. Yeah. All the way down. Yeah. From, and then, you and then out, after you do that, that you're writing your scripts for the next day. Yeah. Or you're writing your scripts for the next couple scenes down the line. Everything already lined yeah. up. So, I, man, I never seen nobody. And then sometimes we'll be right there on set. He thinks up of something better. Something new. <laughs> yeah. right there, the whole so, script damn, the everything top. turns the and then we go and left field with it, you know? Like me, I was supposed to come in, play a little part like that. Oh, you can act. No. Script out the window, writing me new scenes, we doing extra stuff and everything like that. So it's like, you know, like a lot of rappers freestyling whenever they're in the booth. Like improv. Yeah, same way. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, every day's getting better. So it's coming to the point where, like he said, he's waking up writing, editing, filming, then going back to writing, then going back to editing, and going back to filming. So he's basically, you know, with the team that he has too, like you said, K9 and, and Joe and D with behind the scenes and everything, bro. Everything is production just is on point right now. I got a lot of respect for your production, so I can't wait to see all this in the works. Yes. Like, this is, this is, at the yeah, love that you guys have, a lot of people don't understand what it takes to, like, put what? a production on, yeah. put a movie on. A lot of people don't understand, like, no, what those things just work. one hours scene. Hours. I, like didn't, I, I didn't, that. I honestly <laughs> didn't understand it yeah, until right. I moved out here and becoming production assistant and set designer, then I fully understood. This ain't just no, you come on the set and okay, we put it together. Nah, this shit planned like days and days and if something don't go right. You got to figure out how to make that go together. And we all working together from the actors to the production team to the director, we all work together to make sure one person straight. So if you got one person straight, the whole set gonna be cool by the end of the day, and that's how it's been clicking.